Hi, my name is Gabriel, and I'll be presenting our work, Robust Fine-Tuning of Zero-Shot Models, a joint collaboration between the University of Washington, Google Brain, OpenAI, and Columbia University. I'd like to thank my incredible collaborators, Mitchell Wurtzman, John Wu Kim, Mike Lee, Simon Kornblith, Rebecca Ruffles, Rafa Guntiju Lopez, Hannah Haja Shirzi, Ali Farhadi, Hong Nan Kung, and Ludwig Schmidt. One of the foundational goals of machine learning is to create systems that have consistently high accuracy under distribution shift. This is critical for trust and adoption, and is especially important since the data we collect for training is typically different from the data that our models see when they are deployed in the real world. Robustness to distribution shift is still challenging to current systems. For instance, consider a ResNet 101 trained on ImageNet, which has an accuracy of 76% on this data set. If you take the same model and evaluate on ObjectNet, which has objects seen from new viewpoints or new backgrounds, accuracy drops by 44 percentage points. One of the most effective ways of avoiding these accuracy drops is to use zero-shot models, which are not trained explicitly on data from the target distribution. For instance, CLIP by Redford et al. has the same ImageNet accuracy as a ResNet 101 when evaluated in a zero-shot setting, but is 40 percentage points better at ObjectNet. Zero-shot models are hardly perfect, and you typically can gain a lot of accuracy if you fine-tune on data from a target task. However, fine-tuning also deteriorates the robustness to distribution shift that make these models so attractive. In our work, we ask a simple question, can we build a single model that is the best of both worlds, being both accurate and robust? In other words, is it possible to fine-tune without deteriorating robustness to distribution shifts? We argued that the answer is yes, and through a very simple method, by averaging the weights of the zero-shot and fine-tuned models. Given the zero-shot and fine-tuned models, we linearly interpolate between their weights using various mixing coefficients alpha between zero and one. We call this method weight-based ensembles for robust fine-tuning, or YSFT for short. Surprisingly, we find that interpolated models have much higher accuracy out of distribution compared to the fine-tuned model, and sometimes even increase accuracy in distribution. By simply averaging the weights of the zero-shot and fine-tuned models, we obtain a model that is both accurate and robust. Our procedure is very simple and can be implemented in just a few extra lines of PyTorch code, as you can see in the slide. Despite its simplicity, YSFT is very effective. For a VIT L14 model, YSFT improves accuracy on the distribution shift by 3 to 16 percentage points without any drop in accuracy on the target task image head. These improvements come at no extra computational cost at training or at inference, since the models are merged into a single model with the same size. While for the sake of time we showed a highlight of our results, there is much more in the paper, including a variety of other data sets, such as the Wiles benchmark, multiple ablations like how our results are affected by scale, comparisons with other methods like regularization towards the zero-shot model, more models including BASIC, ALIGN, and a GFT pre-trained model, and additional analysis and insights on why our method works, including discussions on a lost landscape perspective. So if you're interested, check out our paper and code using the link on the slides, and please come say hi. Thank you.